Hey everyone, welcome back to another new exciting video. Google finally just released their new next generation ID, which is the Google Anti Gravity, and the UI looks like this, and it is same as the VS Code fork. And the interesting thing is that currently it is available for free to use. And in this model drop-down section here, you see that this Gemini 3 Pro high and low version are available, and also. Cloud Sonnet 4.5 is also available for free to use and also you can change this to first and planning means if you want the planning mode then it will take some time but it will give you the more advanced uh, solution but if you go through this first mode then it will execute the task directly without any planning and another interesting thing is that when I give the same prompt to this anti-gravity and when get the same prompt to this Google AI studio, I found totally different output. And also I don't have the answer that why they are giving the different uh, output and the quality is totally different when you will uh, keep the same prompt to the AI studio and same prompt to the Google anti-gravity. The output is totally different. Here you see uh, inside this anti-gravity, I just gave it this prompt that uh, build a travel booking website UI and after that the output that I have got is uh, this one okay so this is the output that I have got so this is actually cool very cool right and here you see that uh, the trending destination and uh, the hover effect the background so this is typical uh, modern uh, travel agent booking website but when I give the same prompt to the Google AI studio, here you see this kind of output I am getting. This is not that much mature output. Okay, I don't know why the output difference between the two platform, but this is the fact. Okay, so Google anti-gravity is really powerful and it will give you that much really best output. So please use it. Currently it is available for free. And another thing is that, so if you go to this, anti-gravity when I give this prompt here you see that it has generated this kind of images also means by default it has the image generation option and also it has by default browser open option so here you see that uh, I have this kind of things that where anti-gravity would like to use your browser this is the things so after that it will ask you for set up the browser and here you see that it has opened this chromium things and it will ask you to install this browser setup extension so if you just install it okay and after that uh, it will take you to the chrome web store and just click on the add to chrome and it will be added now if you do this after that what will be happen that whatever the uh, website that you are building you can see that uh, quickly inside this uh, this browser and also uh, now whatever the errors that you are getting that will be automatically goes to this um, anti-gravity google anti-gravity that console dot error logs and um, all of that things okay so this is very much helpful and the other things are actually same and you can open the browser here also beside this profile you will get this browser option okay so please use it and when you uh, just uh, download this Google anti-gravity then it will ask you to connect uh, your Google account uh, during installation so just connect that after that you will get this kind of uh, this confirmation that Google anti-gravity you have successfully authenticated okay so please give it a try and uh, you can compare the output with the cursor and wind serve also you please let me know by comparing it and uh, you can take the advantage of this Google anti-gravity the free version the um, limited time free version and uh, you can cancel your cursor or wind uh, subscription also uh, until this anti-gravity is free okay so this was the thing that I wanted to share with you guys please check it and try it and let me know your thought your experience in the comment section see you guys in the next video thanks for watching bye bye take care and if you are visiting this channel for the first time don't forget to subscribe this channel and don't forget to like this video also.